Hey Flight Test, this is David. And I'm Josh. Today we're going to try to make this sled fly. Today's a special day. Over 10 years of flight test existing, we've never ever made Santa sled fly. Today we're going to change that. Let's do it. So in the hobby world, there's something called a PBF or a pizza box flyer. That kind of captures the categories like what nutballs. Uh, people used to take like the signs that you'd have for like elections, and they would just put like a nitro motor on it and cut it and put two little fins on it. Pizza box flyers. They're about the size of a pizza box. They're rectangle or circle. Real simple. This is nothing but basically a pizza box flyer. Uh, you guys can make this. You can even take a dollar sheet of foam board. Uh, make sure it's Adam's Ready Board because that works the best. Um, and just cut elevons in, put a rudder on it, strap a motor in the front. As long as it balances, it'll fly great. It doesn't fly like a typical plane, though, does it? No, no, they're they're pretty uh, doppy, I guess. They're doppy, yeah. <laughs> they, they always fly like in a high alpha, almost like a flying kite, but they're lots of fun. Um, this one, I wanted to try to put more of an airfoil and then also the stabilizer where hopefully it'll fly more like a real sleigh. And maybe it'll snow tomorrow. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm saying that it's supposed to be almost 60 tomorrow. Yeah, I was gonna say, if it, if it snows tomorrow, there's something apocalyptic going on. So this is kind of like what I'm thinking, a lot of the rocket motors. Think that's too far out? Or do you think oh, it needs? That looks good, I think. You think that's good? Yeah. Kind of gives that shadowed look, gives some depth to it. I love it. You love it? Awesome. We'll, um, we'll get the main wing on and get all that centered up, and then we'll figure out where we want our elevator. I think we want to push it as far back as possible. Do you want to do a couple of degrees of positive in the... Uh... That might not be a bad idea. So that way, the way flies like level while this yeah. can... Typically with pizza box flyers, they always fly like Tip this. Up, yeah. So we could... Uh, we could almost angle it like this. Yeah, that looks good. You down with that? Yeah. This is gonna have a little bit of a Grinch stole Christmas vibe, I gotta warn you. <laughs> a little bit of a Grinch stole Christmas vibe. <laughs> that was kinda cool, doesn't it? Yes, it does. That's awesome. Good job. <laughs> Thanks. We got lots of different layers, but that'll be really cool. Awesome. Now, are these gonna protrude on the outside, you think? Yeah, so they, they protrude on the outside. This is the outer part. This lines up on the inner surface and it leaves this step out. And then we just have an inch and a half wide that will mold. Oh, gotcha. I don't think. Maybe we'll do our glide test and stuff before we put these on. So. All right. All right, we're gonna go do a live at manufacturing. Uh, we hit 2 million subscribers. We wanna celebrate that with the crew and uh, we'll bring you guys along with us. <laughs> oh no! That's happened to get too big for you. How are you getting a little faster? Oh no! <laughs> Oh, the windshield's up. Yikes. We're here at our manufacturing facility yep. um, with, yep. I think, the entire team right now. Do, do, yeah. do, 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 do. See, Look at this. There's boxes, right there. there's people over there. there. There's, there's Entire Jen. team minus Mitch, because he's on vacation. Oh, Mitch's on vacation. Yeah. yeah, we got Dave, and then we got Wes back there, Bill. Wes, Bill, and jo Josh is over here in the corner. If you haven't noticed, or if you haven't read the line on the uh, live stream, we just crossed over two million subscribers on YouTube. So, Bob Marhars, thank you so much. But we wanted to kind of come together in the line just to show you what we got going on. 
uh, around the holidays, but also what we do as a team. So, um, uh, but here, let's go check out the rest of the team and the rest of the things going on here. Josh, what do you have to say to the community? Dude, we love you. Thank yes. You on so many different levels. Like, whether we're 200 people or 2 million yeah. in our community, we love you just the same. We want to treat like family. We want to grow as a family. It's a great week. Yeah. That's so it's thank unbelievable. You guys. Thank you guys. You guys literally crush it. Uh, Jason, my dude. What's up, man? This is our, our, our head. Uh, Foam board laser cutter machine. Sounds good to me. That's about it. So um, really what makes this place amazing and awesome is not the boxes and not the organization, not the lasers, it's, it's the people, right? Um, so thank you guys so much for everything you've done for us, getting us to 2 million subscribers and beyond, right? We're, we're still creeping up every single day. Um, and so I think it's time now to not only sign off, but to get moving on some of your guys' orders so that you guys get your stuff in for the Christmas holiday. Um, and we'll see you guys. Have a great happy holidays and a very Merry Christmas and an awesome New Year. We'll see you guys. How did you take off? <laughs> I'm just trying to get some nose weight. Not even close. Not even close. Oh, that's a problem. Reindeer. <laughs> we have reindeer. We may have to. Let me try four cells. Um, you want to check it? You want me to? Uh, yeah. Maybe. Yeah. And by the time you put two like motors, and we can put the batteries right here too. Yeah. Just smaller, like thirteen hundreds or something. Do we want to try to glide it? It's gonna be heavy, but yeah. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> All right. I, I, okay, you ready? Paper cut. Here we go. Here we go. Football. Um, it seemed like it flew. Yeah. I don't know. You want to try it? Hey, Max. Oh boy. It seems straight. It's Actually, I thought it was gonna do that, and it, it was remarkably underwhelming because I was really anticipating something really evil happening, but. Uh, that's actually encouraging. And if you remember we, when we did the flying, um, remember the RC car that oh, went racing yeah. around? When we did that, uh, we kept moving up more and more forward. And then finally, it ended up balancing like up here. Oh. And it, it flew like a dream. So I think this is right. Looks great. Good job. Awesome. Thanks. All right. So we added some plywood uh, inserts here on the inside to kind of strengthen this stuff up. And we're putting a boom on. After we do that, we have the uh, boom clamps that go on here. And the motors are bolted to that, and we should be all set. Now, I'm really excited about the Santa Slay paint job here because we're going to be taking a vintage car look, like the classic 50s and the muscle cars, and we're going to be putting that right on Santa Slay. It's going to look incredible and also have a real edgy twist to it. And while that's paint drying, we're going to have some extra time. I think it's time to play with our favorite flight simulator, and that's from Wings. Wings is not only the sponsor of this episode, but it's also a fantastic partner that we partner with because they make flying so much fun right from the comfort of your own living room. You have the ability to fly FPV and line of sight and also fly with your friends and family up to 16 different people. And for selecting aircraft, you have 27 different detailed aircraft that you can choose from race wings to even some iconic flight test aircraft. Now Wings has recreated four different iconic locations and one of them is Edgewater Air Park right here. They didn't just go ahead and you know make a place that kind of felt like Edgewater, they took satellite views, they took iconic places like our HQ, the pavilions, the runways, and they gave you the ability to fly through the whole entire golf course. On top of detailed locations, you can also use the track builder feature to put gates and feathered flags and different obstacles wherever you want them, maybe even on top of our HQ building. Now this is not just a game, this is a simulator that you can use to build your skills if you're new to flying and you want to experience FPV or simulator racing. And I also love the diversity because you can use any transmitter that can connect to the computer through a USB cable and you're good to go. Now there's going to be a lot of people getting into the hobby around Christmas time and also the winter is a great time to get into the hobby, practice your skills, build your skills, or learn for the first time. And as a special offer to our community, the first 100 people that will go in the description, they click the link and use FT2021 in the discount code, you're going to get a 10% discount when you buy your wing simulator. Alright, so the base color on our flying sleigh is drying now. Let's go ahead and grab some chrome paint and give our friend Dave some help. 
All right, so Dave designed an awesome little 3D printed mount for the Aura here. We're gonna go ahead and mount this. I already rotated it upside down, and a new thing we're trying here is a new transmitter. Typically, you guys see us work with a lot of Spectrum. Over half of our community works with other models. So we're gonna be playing with Radio Master here. Multi-protocol transmitter, incredible bang for the buck. If we like it, we're gonna carry it in the store and also do more tech channel videos around it. So this is my first time ever experiencing it. It already bound up with the DSM, no problem at all. We're gonna drop this in. We're kind of grown for broke here. Like typically we go out with an unpainted, we fly it till it goes good. We don't have good weather coming after this. This is basically our chance to get a slave line before Christmas. So we're just going for broke. I shouldn't say going for broke this bad. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Oh, what yeah. was that? <laughs> well, it is what it we're is. We're going till it's broke. <laughs> I like it. Who's who's driving this sucker? <laughs> <laughs> There's no paper around scissors. I was like, okay guys, let's do it. He's like, boop. He's like, nope. If I point, he has to do it. Do you realize if I crash it, like you're not even gonna have a chance to try it. I'll build another one. <laughs> Dave's like, I build it, I'll just build another one. No, but it looks fantastic first and foremost. I love the red and the like the, the tannish the yellow. That's, this is, this that's is awesome. Santa from the, the classic 50s. Yeah, 50s. Yes. Well, I feel like it'd be Santa with a polar bear holding a Coke. You know what that's I mean? Like, it? I feel like that's yeah, yeah, yeah. like right there. The only thing we're missing is some flames along the front. <laughs> I'm gonna ask a question. What are your your concerns, if any, at this point before you're about to fly? What what would be like? You know, it could go this way. Well, crashing's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> yeah! Yes, no, that's very true. <laughs> Obviously, based on the, like the wing design and like how everything works, what are your biggest concerns? Yeah. Dave, give your opinion first. All right, um, my, my big concern is just with the setup that it has, it has tremendous throws and big ailerons, and everything, all the control surfaces are really close together, which means it's gonna be very twitchy in my opinion. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, um, I, I'm optimistic. Like I was, I was talking about this RC car that we did earlier, the rock crawler. Yeah. Do you remember how it was like totally unflyable, and then we got the CG moved way far forward yes. like a plank, and it flew great? Yeah, it did. Um, I think this, knowing what we learned and how we put that into this, I have more optimism than Nate does. Well, I think it's, it might be a rock. Well, we're going to find out in about 10 minutes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I can't <laughs> wait about that. Where, where, uh, where's Rudolph? I don't know where Rudolph is. I'll go, I'll go find him. <laughs> Just drifted a sleigh. I did. <laughs> <laughs> So are we just gonna go for broke? I, I say we just go for it. All right. Hammer down and no, see you what ready? it does. I'm ready. All right, here we go. Everybody right, take guys. cover. <laughs> well, we got hot glue in. All right, Rudolph, get in the air. It doesn't want to get in the air. <laughs> it is not going up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was awesome. It was just like, Neom. This takes me a flashback to our autonomous ground sleds. Yeah. Hey, let, let's kick the motors up more. More, yeah. we, we may have actually too much nose weight. What's the worst that can happen? I mean, yeah, what is the worst that can happen? Yeah. Right. Oh, 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 we're going to find out. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best laugh I think I've ever heard you have in my entire life. Oh, oh, oh we're going to happen. Well, now, look, now it glides a lot better. Are you ready there, Wesley? Wes, you ready, bro? Yep. Here we go, something. Get in the air, Santa. Oh, oh. Yes! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> All right, yeah. no. are you okay? You got yeah, it? Yeah, nothing with the elevator works. Oh. I'm flying 100 percent off a motor. <laughs> but look at that! Yes! yes. That's great. Santa would oh, be no! no. Oh, oh, there it goes to go, dude! <laughs> dude! That was too yes. much fun. Well, that was on. awesome! Let's, Let's get go. back up in the air. I Let's think there's still a piece left. What happened? Yeah. So there, there was absolutely no elevator control at all, but when you gave it throttle, it was like happy as can be, like dead nuts, stable, well, easy to fly. Um, Santa can do a backflip. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope, yeah. I hope it's not broken too bad because... I think we're golden, I think man. it's flyable. I mean, it didn't really hit that hard. You, you got, like, you got a bend here in the, uh, in the sleigh. Um, so, do you think we're nose heavy? No, I think it's 100% stable. What I think is, is a problem is I think this guy here is doing nothing. I think Do it needs to be elevons. In, I think it needs to be an elevons. Let's, Not ball elevons. Let's just put an <laughs> elevons on it and see what happens. Yeah, yeah, let's go for it. All right, well, <laughs> done. All right, so we have a really cool mix here. We went to differential thrust, elevons now on the back here. So now both the elevators work, but the elevons work down here. 
super simple. Ready to try it again? Let's do it. Round three. <laughs> you ready, buddy? Round three. All right. With the sleigh of Santa. <laughs> All right, Josh, we got it this time. This sketch factor is high now. All right, so sketch factor 1000, instead of taking it off the ground, we're gonna chuck it. Yeah. And then, and because when you chuck it at this height, if it yeah. doesn't work, it's- It's gonna come back and eat us or Dave. <laughs> okay. All right, get ready Here to run, David. Three, two, one. Guys, get yes! it! Yes! Yeah! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that's it's perfect! Play. It's a play. It feels like a ding 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 Oh, it, it gets perfect! It goes sideways, it's a little scary. <laughs> Dude, look at that! It's perfect! It's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> go Dave, go Josh! Look how oh, smooth man, it flies! Oh so nice! It's awesome. It's got so much <laughs> vertical stabilization and... It, guys, this is hands off, look! <laughs> What is this? This is crazy. All right, challenge time, and then we gotta hand it over to you, uh, okay. David Stefan. So what you're saying is you can't really do a touch and go because it won't go off, is we'll, that right? We'll do a touch and stay at the end of it. Okay, <laughs> a touch and slay. <laughs> yes, a touch and slay. <laughs> oh, yes, it goes vertical, it doesn't let's even care. Let's try, let's try a, a flat spin. Yes. Here we go. Flat spin. <laughs> It's more like a spiral. Whoa! Oh, oh, come on yeah! in! <laughs> so, <laughs> it is a mix. It's easy to fly, but it is a mix of rudder, aileron, and something in between an airplane. Oh my. But look how smooth it flies! <laughs> it's making me it, think of my bench. It is! Like it, yeah. it looks like it's flying like I think all of these episodes have warmed us. I got an idea, ready? Yes. Corner. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> loop de loop! It reminds me of something out of like uh, Willy Wonka. Oh, oh. Like, we're good, we're good, we're good. <laughs> when it goes sideways, it scares it, the It has a split personality. Hey, do you want me to hand it to you or do you want me to land it and then? What do you feel, Dave? How hard is it to, to hand? <laughs> Look at this, this guy. Hard. He's like, I don't know if I Here. want it. I'm gonna move out Here. of the way. Here you go. I got it. Now figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, just but, imagine. It's a little bit of rudder, a little bit of aileron. Oh, that is weird, but. but but it flies! It, it flies! flies. <laughs> Santa would be proud, guys. It looks so good. I can't wait to share this with my sons. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna freak out. It's, it's just it's, so weird. It's not hard, but it's not easy. It doesn't fly like an airplane, does it? Is no. it fly like a nutball? No. Uh, okay. Because no. <laughs> that would be terrible. Oh yeah, you got the hang of it. I <laughs> get it, Dave. Do you feel like Santa? Oh ho oh, oh. <laughs> ho. Oh my yeah. gosh! This is the best one they build ever! It's awesome. It's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh. There's some weird things. Oh man. Oh, you wanna try awesome. again, Josh? Huh? Do you wanna fly it again? Uh no, no, I'm good. <laughs> ding 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 Alright, here, why don't we reset? We'll get it back up there. I want Stefan to give it a shot. Oh yeah. Oh yes, Davo. There's your biggest challenge. Oh. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Try to land it, Dave. Right. Ah! If we ever had this, there's no way we'd ever get it on the roof in our life. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Uh, I really don't. Well, we know it doesn't fly like an airplane, so that's, that's why. It's still fairly in one piece, too. Yeah, yeah. Let's go check out the damage, shall we? <laughs> he was like, "Do you hear me?" He's like, "Oh, oh!" oh. <laughs> Listen, oh I think. Sorry, I'm Josh. Sorry, I think, you, you know what? It's next. okay, guys. It's okay. I had a blast. Look at this. I mean, overall, though. <laughs> It took the front, you know, of the nose of off, yeah. right? It's just a flesh wound. And really, just the power system. You know I mean, yeah. everything else seems to be... I don't know, it, I don't know it, what took it out, but do you notice when we were doing the loops, there was a certain point it would kick out where yeah. it, it, it like blanked out. I think when you're coming down and it was fast, and then you had to give it throttle, I think something just... Shoot, it, torquey torque or something? Yeah, yeah. But you know, at the end of the day, one day build, we built the sled, it flew, and it looked great. And it looked great. Oh, <laughs> Merry Christmas, friends. Uh, from our flight test family to you guys, uh, you have blessed us with an amazing year. We truly hope that you and your family get to get together, have some time of fellowship, time of connecting, and maybe even build a plane along the way. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. See you guys. See ya.